Welcome everyone to another episode of Extreme Power and No Handling. Today we're dealing with a 1991 Jeep Grand Wagoneer. Now this originally had 144 horsepower, but now it has 750 horsepower from its V8 engine and weighs 4,339 pounds. So yeah, it has way more power than it had originally and it's still got the poor handling that had originally been a uh, giant, heavy, off-road vehicle. And yeah, even though it does have more power, uh, it's still going to be not the fastest ever, but it still should have decent acceleration. And the all-wheel drive might help in terms of grip round corners, but yeah, it's still a big off-road vehicle that was never meant to handle uh, a track uh, course like this in the first place. So yeah, let's see what it can or can't do. Now, other off-road vehicles have done decently, though the last Jeep wasn't the slowest, but it certainly wasn't the fastest either. Putting about a 1 minute 29 lap time. I guess my fears about it being a bit slow were unjustified. It's certainly not slow. Despite all that weight. It can handle the corners, it's yet to be seen. Be that old World War II Jeep, and I'd be surprised. Because that was a handful after all. This at least has a weight to push down on those tyres. So should at least have a bit more grip than that old Jeep did. Decent time, we can avoid the oversteering issues we have on the second lap, we'll be alright. Not quite sure if it's going to be the fastest 4x4 we've had, but if it is, then this has surpassed my expectations by a country mile, that's for sure. a bit earlier than you'd uh, in a normal car though, with all this weight. And that was like the best thing apart about this vehicle anyway. Being a 24 year old car.
And there we go. A remarkably quick time. 1 minute 22.651. So let's have a look at that on terms of the leaderboard. It's 1 minute 22.651. Let's just check that, yeah. Yeah. And yeah, that is the quick before we've had by a very, very wide margin. Uh, you have to go all the way back to the Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon and that's 1 minute 27.88 so yeah several seconds quicker than the fastest 4x4 vehicle we had originally and yeah far better than I was expecting it to be I was expecting it to be wallowy, I was expecting it to be quite slow with all that weight and I was expecting it to handle like a pig but yeah handled far better than I was expecting it to and yeah I guess the fact that it was uh, only expected to have a decent um, amount of power originally 144 horsepower back then for a vehicle of this size and more far more about a family vehicle than anything else to have that amount of power has clearly helped because yeah it clearly was meant to handle a whole, whole lot more horsepower than uh, it was originally obviously not 750 but you know what I mean anyway thanks for watching and uh, hope to see you in the next one bye